You might have wondered, what did these food products have in common? With our diets evolving, we move towards more sustainable, healthier and more nutritious food. While cooking breakfast, Leo and his family select fresh ingredients to prepare the most delicious breakfast in town. To fortify the waffles with proteins, Anna, Leo's daughter, suggested adding insects in the form of a versatile powder, which brings diverse nutrients that are necessary for a healthy meal. Anna was inspired to incorporate complementary food products into the diet of her family by her aunt, Victoria, who is a nutritionist. Every time she goes out with her friends, Victoria tells them about the importance of a balanced diet for a healthy lifestyle. Being a flexitarian, Victoria tries to eat fish at least once a week and her favorite dish is grilled fish. While Luca, Victoria's colleague from work, prefers the delicious insect burgers. Whenever she goes shopping, Victoria looks for fresh EU farmed fish fed with sustainable and nutritious ingredients such as insects. Along with fruit, vegetables and nuts, she also buys eggs from insect-fed chickens or meat from insect-fed pigs. Luca agrees that novel food products can play a key role in making our diet healthier. While he did not have the best grades in history, Luca remembers that the Romans and the Greeks cooked different kinds of insects as a delicacy. Listening to his friend's piece of advice, he adds whole insects to his salad or post-workout food. Across Europe, edible insects and insect-fed animal products are becoming more and more common. The European Commission also recognised the potential of novel sources of protein and committed to fostering EU-grown proteins, including insects, under its farm-to-fork strategy to facilitate the development of the EU regulatory framework. Since 2015, IPIF works closely with the European Commission and EU member states. Representing insect business operators from over 20 countries in EU's capital, Brussels, IPIF plays a central role in bridging the gap between insect farming and policy making. Looking for ideas about how to make your diet more sustainable?